Ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? My name is Tom Origins and today we've been given a gift. We have been given the brand new Master Shredder for Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. This is one of their first big collaborations and we know thanks to a leak from Modern Warfare 2 there are plenty more branded collaborations to come in future seasons. Comment down below which one you think you'll see next and for now subscribe, ding dong the notification bell and enjoy this video. Yeah, that's right, ladies and gentlemen, we got a new operator. Woohoo! If you grew up watching a certain number of uh, small green ninja turtles, you'll know who this man is. This is the Shredder Tracer Pack. Now, if I had a bingo card for Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, I could never tell you how likely this would be to end up on my bingo card. It probably would never even come in the top 1%. I had an inkling they may have done a Scream collaboration, similar to what they did in Black Ops and in Modern Warfare 2. But to be fair to them, Shredder's not a bad pick. This whole season, which we've got 21 days left of, has been a sort of samurai thing with a Sheikah Island and stuff like that. And by the way, pre-emphasis, I'm sorry for the pronunciation of any of these if I say it wrong, but let's break open the Shredder pack and show you how to get it. First of all, you're going to need 2,400 COD points. I've got a video coming out soon showing you guys how to get multiple operator skins for the price of one bundle. So I'll do that in a separate video, not to confuse you, but let's get into this bundle. So for the price of 2,400 COD points, you're going to obtain Master Shredder himself, which is pretty pretty cool so <laughs> tonight you dine on turtle soup is the tagline for this operator skin so preview of master shredder in his glory looking fabulous there he's got a red and black armament going on there some almost deadpool-esque kind of outfit going on to begin with but he comes with a little backpack with a a certain a little green tank substance on his back there which is kind of almost iconic from the show we we kind of know where that's going what is what his evil plans are but he's got this really cool helmet these awesome shoulder pads here with the spikes and stuff and he's got obviously the amazing like sort of wrist gauntlets kind of looking like batman uh it looks pretty cool pretty nice outfit doesn't look out of place to be fair thought it would look a lot more weird and cartoonish but it actually looks kind of cool kind of looks realistic and his shotgun, the Oroku, I believe it's called, the Oroku. Take this shotgun into Warzone and tear up the competition with a high capacity mag and close range power. This thing has got damage range, hip fire accuracy and magazine ammo capacity. I believe it's the brand new shotgun and it's the first blueprint for that. It's got a red claw slash impact, which kind of sounds cool. And a death effect called the claw thrash flurry, which kind of sounds fun. So not going to lie, looking forward to use that. Next, we have the SMG build, which is the, I think it's an SMG. Oh, no, it's an assault rifle. It's for the hemlock. It's called the Saki, I think, built on, what's it called? Built on the principle of speed, this hemlock will have the competition thinking you have ninja fast reflexes. Ooh. These dual, I call them katanas, but they're not. They're called Katoshis, Katoshis? I don't, Kadoshis? I don't know, I'm sorry for the mispronunciation. Steel Claws, which is a new variant for this new weapon, this new melee weapon has just been out on the battle pass. So this is uh, Shredder's Blades. Taste Shredder's Blades is the tagline for this weapon. Looks awesome in the field. We're going to have two of these bad boys, so looks tremendous. On top of that, we get this awesome silver and red tank. Kind of looks like Megatron. Not gonna lie, it looks like what Megatron would transform into. Kinda looks pretty cool. I'm really excited to see that. That's awesome. Then there's awesome animation, which they do not let us preview, which is annoying, but we will preview it and I'll show you a clip of it in this review. Also the Red Foot Clan uh weapon charm, this awesome little decal, and this awesome emblem. So let's get this pack and let's put it into the test. And just before I show you the Master Shredder. Uh, in game and what his takedown and weapons look and play like i'll try it in warzone and i'll try it in close quarters multiplayer as well which is the current playlist out right now but just for notice reference he's on the cortac uh side so i've got the klaus skin that was released in december so once you have him you can equip him and then if you want to display him in a lobby you press y to star the cortac team and you will see him and you can also go a step 
closer than that because you can see here on his customizations tab he will come with his operator finishing move which is the shred em, shred em up which is kind of cool and uh basically you can also equip that on other operators i just don't know if it'll play or look as right but if you also want him to be displayed with his signature weapon or one of his signature weapons uh you put it onto a class like this like i've done with a shotgun and his katana and just go to options and then just set that as favorite class and then when you return to the lobby uh go to your lobby he should appear any moment any moment now there he is there he is with his beautiful shotgun and that's how I look in Warzone lobbies, DMZ lobbies, and multiplayer lobbies. So, let's load into a multiplayer game and see what this looks like in-game. Does perfect even mean? 